down. All right, this yeah. is the one that you Brim fans yeah, have been waiting for. Down. 13 kilos plus of Brim needed for Mark Healy to win the Daiwa round of the Daiwa Brim series in Gippsland Lakes. He spent all of his time up at Tom's Creek near Holland's Landing. And here are some of his classic catches. Jagged him, you reckon? <laughs> That's a bag, though. Is it? Yeah. yeah, three little ones and two big ones. Alright. Mark used three different outfits, but only one bait a deep diving jackal chubby in brown suji colour to pick the eyes out of this big brim factory. She did get a sore neck. Watching them fuck around. Yeah, it's not really my thing, but no. I mean, it's good, it's just I don't quite know that. Not in a. That's better, that's a bit better. That's a good bite. Yeah, big hunt. Yeah, it's good, mate. Yeah. Yeah, I'm here, mate. Might be another carp. Oh, really? Do you know? Clunked it, though. No, no it's a brim. Nah. You're on, Jake. Just run his bag, though, actually. You can't go. No, I just...
nothing huge, but yeah. maybe upgrade them. Yes. You. I wish I fall again. Good job. Yeah. Sydney's Ahmad Mafood fished the ramp of death at Meetung for a couple of days straight nearly. He caught some crackers off there and it was good enough for fourth place. Allahu Akbar! MashaAllah! Whoa, 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 easy, easy, easy. That's how you start. Check that one out. Not bad, good size. That's beautiful! And how good is Gippsland fishing? Over 1,800 fish recorded in the ABT app, and over 9 kilos was only good enough for eighth place. Well, I haven't had a bite on the crab yet, so. <laughs> You see your warm up done? Rattle, rattle. I'll, I'll, I'll make this one, it's not very big. Keep fishing. Show might have lied, it might be all right. <laughs> I'll, I'll get it, it's all good. Yeah, it got bigger. <laughs> He got a lot bigger. So he was hooked under the guts or something. He's an alright one, isn't he? It's just he'll come up when he's ready to come up. Thank you very much. <laughs> alright, that started the day off with the right one. That's the right to get the day started. Number one. Bites. The pinky, I think. Might still be a pinky. Nah, I don't think so. Another little one. That's right, I'll need him. You keep doing what you do. No, no, I don't need it. It's not even upgraded, I don't think. But I will have the net, I think. That sat on the bottom for ages before he ate it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think he's an upgrade. I think I'm sure I've just polled him nearly. Chomp the crabby. Mm -hmm.
Could be bigger. Could be. No, I'll need him. It's right. Yeah, it might be an upgrade, that one. I'll need him still. Man, it's finesse technique, eh? Hey? They're just sipping it. Sipping that thing. Upgrade something. Did you get him on the wind out? On the, just as I started winding, he, he ate it, just as I started giving it to him. And of course, when you're playing around structure on light line, you don't win them all. Trouble, 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 trouble. Hasn't got out yet. Nah. <laughs> he grabbed it and went in with it. And there's trouble with the capital T. A while back, I think, yeah. That's why the water's still a little bit discolored, I think. That was a patch of brim. I reckon you could see him about 90 feet out on the live scope, that patch. I don't think it's that big. I don't know. No, it doesn't feel like it. Come here, mate. Come here, come here. Thank you, mate. Mm, he got smaller, didn't he? he? Got smaller in the net. There. And a big thanks to Rapala's Harry Schofield for providing these highlights. Loving his new job and loving the new baits he's throwing.
Made it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one. Proper one. And last but not least, Sydney's Aaron Tracy was pretty stoked to get his 10 out of 10, including this three peat down at Lakes Entrance. So you're on yeah. this side. Yeah, you can get snagged on that back one. You're right. Oh. <laughs> That's a horse. Let's go. <laughs> And there was massive interest in the live scoreboards from this and all of the other Vic ABT road trip events. You can see the live scoreboards and all of the coverage on abt.org.au.